Jumping with the military, you're probably wondering how I got to this point. Well, I had to train first. So you think you're ready? Oh, I know I'm ready. Fix your tie. Be ready. Backpack isn't true. Mayor Leclerc isn't true. Ellis Ross isn't true. Three, four, ninety-nine, one hundred. So I'm ready to go. All I need to do is walk through that door. Wrong door, Zach. Shoot. I'm now by Regan Babiak. Um, tell me, Regan, you seem pretty excited for the first part of the morning. You're also going to be jumping out of the airplane with me. Are you more excited that you're going to be jumping out of the airplane or you pipped off work for the next hour? Um, I think it's a combination of both. Now all we need to do is pack. For the most part, you're packing it like any Air Canada bag. Just shove it all in. However, Flying away feels like any other Air Canada flight until they open up that back cargo door and say, well, this is our stop. Never have I ever been so nervous and without warning, off I go. Wind rushes in your face, your ears feel like you're in a hurricane and the sky below rushes at tremendous speeds. My mouth loathed for a glass of water after consuming thousands of feet of unbreathed air but my eyes loathe for the view of Terrace. Then, it pops. The parachute is thrown, and... Silence fell over the crowd. You can't hear anything, the wind isn't brushing in your face anymore, and you're just taking in the view, until you fall to a smooth landing. Right, you see all of Terrace, you look, there's my house, and, and there's my work, and, and this is where I go get groceries, like everything is just so tiny. Like if you would have told me that I had to climb that high on a ladder or like a telephone pole, I'd probably be shaking and, you know, scared. But for some reason, it's just when you have the parachute out, you don't feel any of that, you know? It's, it's almost really calming. Reporting from Much Drier Pants, I'm Zach Power for CFTK-TV News.